Uh, Professor, welcome back. You've been in Jamaica about three weeks now on your second stint here with the national team well, as technical director for all of Jamaica's football program. Since you've been here, what have you, have you been doing in regards to the senior team qualifying for 2010? I'm doing a lot of things. Mm -hmm. it's not, uh, I think what we want in this stint, second stint, do something different than mm -hmm. what we did in the first one. I think it was good. We qualified to France. The senior team we qualified under 17 to New Zealand World Cup. We qualified uh, under 20. The World Cup was in Argentina. We got a Caribbean Cup. We play a wonderful 1998 Gold Cup. Mm -hmm. So when you look at the results, we play 49 games in the national stage, just just the first the first one mm -hmm. against US. So that's a very good record. Mm -hmm. But after that, what happened? Mm -hmm. So uh, I think we we need to think this time to 2010 and beyond. Honestly, looking at Jamaica's football now, where would you rank us in CONCACAF? I, I think uh, on field, there is a lot of improvement. I think you have more urgence to play games. I think in 1994, when I arrived here, they pro played football very similar the way cricket is played. <laughs> because what happened in the cricket, uh, the bowler has the ball, and he goes to bowling, and the other team is wait on him, his actions, and cricket is a reaction. So the one team make a movement, the other team react for that movement. Football is not that. Football there is a prevention. You have to avoid that the opponent team make actions. So that's the re it's necessary movement on and off of the ball. I think there is much more now. I think the, 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 the stadiums now, when they came here in 94, you have a football team. Now I think you have football clubs. They have a small stage, yes, but the, the field now, all of them, the grass is much, much better than before. So the players, they understand they have to play as a team now. They play more as a team than individuals that they played before. So in this aspect, I think there is a lot of improvement. I am really satisfied with that. In our first round, we play, I think, two Caribbean opponents, and we move on to a very tough group with, I think it's Honduras, Canada, and Mexico. Um, what, what do you think, it, what will be necessary for Jamaica to get out of that, 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 that group and move on? My answer today, it's exactly the same I gave in 1994 when they asked me that. And if you remember, we play against Suriname, two games, away and home. The after we play Barbados, away and home. And the after we went for a group, very interesting, was Mexico, Honduras, St. Vincent and Jamaica. Mm -hmm. And what happened? Jamaica was number one, Mexico was number two. So I think the possibilities is the same. It's not not so you think that a repeat is possible. No, I, I'm not saying we go to do it. Mm -hmm. I'm saying there is a chance. If there is a chance, you have to dream, but not dream and wait. You have to work very hard. This is what we, we are doing. This is what you, you, you want to build is a team with spirits, the spirits of Jamaica. That's why encourage us to dream as Jamaica can do something. The weak team can beat the, the, the strong, strong team. Our professor, thanks a lot for your time and all the best in your endeavors. Thank you very much.